But first tonight, breaking news of the Bronx mayhem in a park packed with people when someone started shooting. Four people hit, including two young brothers. It happened at St. James Park in the Kingsbridge section. I would assume Jim Dolan live at the scene with new surveillance video of the two suspects cops are looking for. Jim. Bill, those brothers are just three and six years old, and they were shot tonight here in St. James Park along with two adult males. Just moments ago, the NYPD released this surveillance video. They say shows the two men who fired the shots uh, on a bike just before the shooting. Police say they got off of that bike, walked up to the entrance of the park, and started firing. The child was hit, a neighbor says in Spanish, and on the ground at East 193rd Street, a six-year-old boy with a gunshot wound to his leg was bleeding on the sidewalk. The gunshot started just before 6 o'clock on the street next to St. James Park, full of people on a midsummer night. So, of course, there were others hit. The ambulance was delayed, so a police officer picked up the six-year-old gunshot victim and carried him down the street to a cruiser the officer drove that six-year-old boy to a nearby hospital. I listen, pa, 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 but oh, I don't know, it's terrible with the kids. Maria had just been outside with her grandson a few minutes before the gunfire. Javier was working in his apartment. When I hear uh, at least this chap, at least, but I, in the Bronx over here, that's normal. It's normal, he says, to hear gunfire here. Four people were shot, two adult males, the six-year-old and a three-year-old boy were hit. All are expected to survive. Two people with no regard for society or life will pull up to a crowded park on East 193 Street here in Kingsbridge, fire into that park where hundreds of people were congregating on a hot July day. Uh, this is totally unacceptable. Used to be, families felt comfortable outside on the street here. But now it's afraid. It's stay in my house, everybody, because it's horrible. They're all staying inside because they're afraid to be out. Exactly. Police say the two gunmen were wearing all black clothes and masks. It will be difficult to identify them. None of the injuries considered life-threatening.